Hello, my friends. This is a map of beautiful Tanzania. The vast majority of tourists visit Tanzania and Zanzibar or a northern circuit of Serengeti National Park, the Ngorongoro Conservation Area, Terengir National Park, Lake Manyara National Park, and Mount Kilimanjaro. In 2013, the most visited national park was Serengeti, followed by Manyara and Terengir. The Bank of Tanzania is the central bank of Tanzania and is primarily responsible for maintaining price stability. With a subsidiary responsibility for issuing the banknotes and coins of the Tanzanian shilling. At the end of 2013, the total assets of the Tanzanian banking industry were TSH 19.5 trillion. A 15% increase over 2012. Zanzibar Harbor is nice. Most transport in Tanzania is by road. With road transport constituting over 75% of the country's freight traffic and 80% of its passenger traffic. The 86,500 km road system is in generally poor condition. Tanzania has two railway companies, TAZARA, which provides service between Dar es Salaam and Kapiri Mpashi in a copper mining district in Zambia, and Tanzania Railways Limited, which connects Dar es Salaam with central and northern Tanzania. Rail travel in Tanzania often entails slow journeys with frequent cancellations or delays. And the railways have a deficient safety record. Excuse me. Please comment if you love Tanzania. Continuing. In Dar es Salaam, there is a huge project of rapid buses. Dar Rapid Transit, DART, which connects suburbs of Dar es Salaam City. The development of the DART system consists of six phases and is funded by the African Development Bank, the World Bank and the Government of Tanzania. The first phase began in April 2012, and it was completed in December 2015 and launched operations in May 2016. Tanzania has four international airports. Along with over 120 small airports or landing strips, airport infrastructure tends to be in poor condition. Airlines in Tanzania include Air Tanzania, Precision Air, Fastjet, Coastal Aviation, and Zan Air. Water supply and sanitation in Tanzania has been characterized by decreasing access to improved water sources in the 2000s, especially in urban areas. Steady access to some form of sanitation, around 93% since the 1990s, intermittent water supplies, and generally low quality of service. Many utilities are barely able to cover their operation and maintenance costs through revenues because of low tariffs and poor efficiency. There are significant regional differences, with the best performing utilities being Russia, Moshi, and Tanga. That's all for now. Please subscribe for the best maps and for the love of Tanzania. Goodbye.